Jurassic World, Fallen Kingdom Director Talks Sad Scene. Warning, this article contains spoilers from Jurassic World, Fallen Kingdom If any part of Jurassic World, Fallen Kingdom made you cry, it's probably the moment towards the end with that Brachiosaurus. As Owen, Chris Pratt, Claire, Bryce Dallas Howard, and Franklin, Justice Smith, escape island nubbler on the final boat leaving the island before it's destroyed, they see a desperate Brachiosaurus stuck on the island, unable to save itself from the volcanic eruption. The scene has had moviegoers sobbing in their cinema seats and it turns out that they aren't the only ones, as director Jay Bayona has explained how he created a somber atmosphere on set. That scene represents the ending of a dream that started 25 years ago, he told The Hollywood Reporter. You are telling the ending of that island and the ending of that dream. I played a very sweet and a little sad version of the Jurassic Park melody, on the set. So that was very effective for the actors, especially for Bryce. Being there, telling that story, listening to music from John Williams, they were all very emotional. The fact that Abrachosaurus was the first ever dinosaur to be introduced to the Jurassic Park franchise back in 1993, and therefore viewers, makes this death even more hard-hitting. But there is a ray of hope at the end of Fallen Kingdom despite the destruction of the island, as fan-favorite Velociraptor Blue is shown in the film's final shot looking out over a Californian neighborhood. We leave the island behind and then we set up a universe that we've never seen before. You have this cliffhanger at the end, Bayona said. I think Colin has a lot of possibilities in front of him right now. Jurassic World, Fallen Kingdom is out now in the UK and US. Book your tickets here. Want up to the minute entertainment news and features? Just hit like on our Digital Spy Facebook page and follow on our at Digital Spy Instagram and Twitter account.